I tell Horst to go down to Southeast Lot and steal the most expensive thing he can drive, which he does. And we box it up and ship it to every port he can name. Where is it now? Somewhere between New Orleans and the West Coast. How's that for your kid, brother? You said you were gonna bring something over? Just this. Read it. What is it? A confirmation letter, like. You know that labor position on the Port Advisory Board, that one I was telling you about? I put you up for it. You're on. I'm on, huh? I ain't been union since they closed the dry dock. How come I'm on? The board chair and me, we got a relationship. You mean you greased it? <laughs> the chairman, he thought you'd be right for it, is all. There's a stipend comes with it. A couple hundred a month, Lou. <laughs> when I get home at night, I just want to watch a ball game or something. <laughs> I'm not up to go to no meetings or anything. Christ, Lou, you don't... Eat. You don't got to go to all the meetings. You show up once in a while. Let them know you're alive. That's not for me. <sighs> What's for you? That shit wagon parked out front needs a battery? Or this kitchen here been rigged the same way for 25 years? Whatever I got comes straight. <sighs> oh, that's real noble, big brother. Not noble. Right. The shipbuilder's local goes belly up. That makes you some kind of martyr. Hell, the only difference between me and you is you picked the wrong union. That ain't the only difference. If you were in my position... I'm not. And I tell you the truth, I'm glad I don't have to make those kind of choices. Come on, kid. Sit down. You really used to raise pigeons with my peepop. We 